calculate the height of the tallest building in the world, Burj Khalifa, in Dubai using similar triangles. So here we what we've got is uh, one triangle here, and then we've got this other smaller triangle here, and we're being asked to estimate the height, or use that to calculate the height of the Burj Khalifa, which is the tall currently the tallest building in the world. So using similar triangles now one good idea when you've got similar triangle is to draw them out separately so we're going to take that small one and draw it out here so that's going to be 315 and 210 it is right angled and then we're going to draw out the large one i.e the smaller one is actually inside the larger one so now we're going to be careful because this distance here is the addition of 315 plus 700 and 95 and this is that's equal to 1110 meters and then this distance here that we want to find is the height and then we're going to make similar triangles so we're going to say h over 1110 is going to be equal to the same h on the smaller triangle 210 divided by 315 and then we're going to multiply both sides by 100, uh, 1, 1,110, so that's going to give me 210 times 1,110 divided by 315, and then on my calculator that will give me 740 meters, which is approximately the height. So, which is approximately the height of the tallest building in the world. Okay, so this has been a video to show you how to. Uh, calculate the height of a building using similar triangles. I hope you've understood and I thank you very much for watching.